Hey there folks and friends, Connecting Dots here. Continuing on here with this massive YouTube fraud promoted by many well-known YouTubers. Let me mention some of them again in case you missed them. Nibiru Magic 2012, Missing Sky 101, Miss Melky the Clown, Stacy Anderson, Kevin D. Blanche, Dutch Sense, Montagraph, Dabu7, Jeff Rents, Alex Jones, Oh, I know I forgot a few hundred other ones here, but at least I'm out here debunking this stuff, and I hope you all remember these names because in the end here, very close, the we're, we're near the end here. I hope you guys realize that. Anyone who's been paying attention, you already realize this guy's been debunked. But I mean, for the rest of you here who are still following um, his lies that's promoted by many others, the others that I just mentioned here, is near an end there's no doubt about it here i got some great footage coming up but again here in last night's show again he's changed it again if for, uh, he, this is a second video that was put out last night the first one was almost dead the pacific ocean is almost dead i'm not sure if you saw that one but i uploaded on my youtube channel and i'm going to get into it in a second here because i put out another video again proof here of life he doesn't want to accept it instead he's come out he's thrown it into a witch hunt Boy, oh boy, listen to what comes out of this latest words here on this last video from last night. Just listen to this because this is where this video is going to debunk him that he's an absolute liar. He's telling folks lies, hiding, not giving proper pictures of what's going on. Is that as we go out and we launch, and we got reports all around the island, there's nothing. So that's what we're going to end up with on the cameras, unfortunately absolute lying those of you who've been uh, posting comments and i know because I've, I've many uh, have contacted me here saying how beautiful girl by dane has been deleting the comments there's no doubt about it here we all know he has and it's coming to an end and uh, the pacific ocean is not dead he's changing his tune now and um, as you may have seen last night's video there's now threats now he's going to hunt us down trace our ip address find out who we are where we live hunt us down and hang us in a tree whoa i can't believe it and he's organizing an army to do so these are his own words i'm not making this stuff up you can go watch the video here i just uploaded last night this is the way this gentleman speaks so we have a loose cannon here that's now uh censoring the proof this video is going to debunk him folks and i've been asking for donations for a while back here on my connecting dots 2 channel I have two YouTube channels, Connecting Dots 2, Connecting Dots 3. They have the same video uploaded where I'm asking for donations because I actually want to check the seafood, the kelp, all of the things that need to be verified. And coincidentally, he mentioned this video here, Vancouver Island. Again, that's where I am. There's lots of life here, and this video is going to debunk it. And I just want to ta uh, uh, tackle another thing regarding the comments. Many of you have mentioned your comments are not showing up. Well, look at this video here. I just put it up It's just a, a couple hours ago. It says 30 comments. I deleted two of them because they're his trolls that come out and say crap about me. The rest of them should be there. They're not. Okay, you scroll down here. That's the video itself. That's all the comments that are there. I did not delete any other comments. And, uh, you know, beautiful fraud by Dana. Yes, you're doing a great job here. Uh, he was threatening you and me because in my this video here I showed how it's actually myself that's been doing a, a, a lot of these debunking videos I have not found another single video on beautiful girl by Dana debunking him I'm the only one who's been out putting out videos every single day and even your playlist that you're leading everyone to go show on your YouTube channel well all of the videos except for one are mine so yes I've been the main drive behind this and I'm not trying to I'm not looking for any reward on this in fact at the opposite we need to join in together we need to build a real army of truth we need to debunk this all together because I can't do it myself I can only make a videos you folks uh, lucky for me you all have Google plus account so you can go leave comments I don't know how long they're gonna stay here because as I've mentioned Google is deleting them but in this latest video here by someone who I've been promoting Claire Stanhope okay she lives on where Sunshine Coast exactly where he says it's all dead done dead hold on a second here where is this place it's right here that's right so I'd mention here I'm on Vancouver Island the, here's the Strait of Juan de Fuca that's been carrying in all this radiation that you heard on the Jeff Rents show or these radio shows that, that Dane has been talking about. Uh, Jeff Rents, I've pointed out here, he's all part of that corrupt alternative news online fear-mongering 
um, baseless facts. So Dana lives in Powell River. This video was taken right there. Now before we get into that, let me just tackle one more topic here. This comment right here, left two hours ago by Claire, where she talks about Dana's antics remind me of Hitler coming into power. Couldn't have said it better myself. Very scary how this person has managed, along with many other YouTubers, and that's why I keep saying, I keep stressing, remember their names. They're all in this together. None of them want to make a video like me debunking the truth. They all have thousands of subscribers, many, many more subscribers than I do. None of them want to tackle the truth. Remember you heard it here on this YouTube channel here, and I will promote any other person that's out for the truth. You lying scammers are in it. We're going to join up together. We're going to make our own army of truth. Another thing, uh, you know, she says, I will gladly take your GoPro underwater with some snorkeling gear if you'd like. Folks, I've been talking about this, how I've got this little GoPro camera here that you can stick on your uh, diving mask, hold in your hand. Uh, I specifically said how we don't necessarily have to go diving here. It's ne more about getting this uh, sea life that's apparently disappeared in the... Uh, <laughs> Title uh, pools, I can't believe you would say something like that. But regardless here, it's a very small camera, takes very great footage here. Um, I've talked about how I just need to buy this casing. I need some traveling expense, a uh, hotel for about three, four nights. In fact, I may actually sleep outside because I, I, mentioned, I mentioned in the past here, I'm a real outdoors person. So I'm actually sleep outside in a tent here. Uh, no, no tent, outdoors, okay, on the wild coast here. So, and I'll get some footage here. Let's see what you, a lot of stuff's alive you got to know where to look for it, okay? So someone's going to put up a picture here and tell you all it's all dead. Yeah, that's got to come to an end. So I'll leave a link down below here, radiation monitoring tour. I did this back in 2011, went across Canada doing a check of uh, the fallout from the 2011 meltdown here. Yes, I had two Geiger counters, still have them. If you want to help out, links are down below. I know to a lot of you, you already know the truth. You don't need any more proof, but let's remember there's a lot of folks here who have not waken up to the truth. They're still caught up in this lie. So help out, put in a couple of bucks, folks. All of us together here will make a difference. I've already got $62 here. Let's see where we can go from here. Okay, on with some proof. But one more thing, again, Dana's getting a lot of help. And again, here, this is another person. John has, uh, well, he, he's made a video, Fukushima Crab Fighting for Survival. Now, oddly enough, if you take a look at the size of those boulders, boulders, the stones, I should say, not boulders, if you go take a look at the size of those stones, those are the exact same type of stones where Dana had taken a picture from far away and said there was no life. You just got to throw in some food in there and they'll all come out. So these aren't Fukushima crabs. They're definitely alive, eating just like crabs do. Okay, so I won't be playing the entire video, just clips of it. I'll leave a link down below for the entire video. There's all those seagulls that don't live on the west coast anymore. Of course, it's lies. Huge flock of seagulls. See all those little white dots? Those are all seagulls. Harbor seals hanging out. Oh, on the, all the vegetation. Look at all the mussels on there. Mussels. Oh, not the ones that have disappeared. Oh, look at that. Signs of life and mussels. More life. More. Uh oh, what's that? Not those birds that have apparently moved off the west coast that no longer live here. Oh, she's just arrived. Look at all that seagrass. Wow, look at it all. Look at all those sand dollars. Holy crap. I've never seen so many. Oh my god, I've never seen that many either. I feel bad, I'm like crunching them all up when I walk over them. I know, it's funny, it looks like dead, but look at all of those oysters. It's insane! Hermit crabs. Is there washrooms? Is there really? I can't compare. 
Uh -huh. Anything in there? Lots of fish and stuff. My phone beat? Yeah. We got Some little phone? baby oh, no, oysters no, no. growing here. Right. See, Claire, there's no life. It's from the freaking nuclear. Oh, no. Little snails. And then in the afternoon, I. Yeah, they're all vanished, folks. Ugh, they're trying to eat my toes. Here's a little crab attacking a hermit crab. Lots of life. You gotta know where to look He's for like, it. Get away, get away. Are like trying to eat my toes. They're pinching me. We got crabs fighting each other. Hermit crabs everywhere. There's those birds that have all disappeared, folks. So it looks like Dana and Terry Daniels are misleading everyone, telling them all that the West Coast is dead. Yeah, no birds. Just thousands and thousands of barnacles, oysters, mussels, seaweed, crabs, like. Yeah, no sand dollars. That's what he said. 200 kilometers. She went to one beach, folks. Look at all those black sand dollars. The black ones are alive. The white ones are dead. There's thousands upon thousands of them just in that one little beach. There she goes. She's going snorkeling. That's clear, folks. Wait till she gets People to go keep them at Guess what she has in her hands? You got it. Thousands of them. Okay, well, maybe not thousands of them. Uh, she has a lot of them. The point is, they're there. Dana doesn't want to go looking for them. He wants to take pictures from far away and tell you there's nothing there. Put it in the shade. Like put, yeah, there. Wow. Uh oh, oh. sand fleas. More life in a tide pool. Imagine that. If only Dana had gone closer during those nine days. Instead, he wasted his money, took a couple little pictures from far away, then lift up a single rock, no video footage, just a couple of pictures, the same pictures over and over again, saying there's no life. Fraud, folks. Fraud. <laughs> Leaving now. So that's a shortened version of her video if you want to go watch the entire yes. thing. The link's down below. There's no doubt about it. Lots of life on the west coast. Uh, yeah. I found a dead one. More life on her way home. And I suspect that was why. Okay, so I'm going to end it here. I'll leave a link down below for this entire video. And please, why not subscribe to Claire Stanhope, folks? We need to join together, us truthers, real truthers. Real people on YouTube, real people, not none of these fake YouTubers. And please, please, if anything, remember the names that I mentioned at the beginning of the video. If you can't recall them, go back to the beginning, listen to them. And if you're, if you're able to, why not send us a little bit of cash or send me a little bit of money? I'm going to go over and see Claire. We'll hook her up with the GoPro. She'll go underwater, get some great footage, folks. We'll put an end to this line telling folks that everything's dead. No. Here's the real problem on the West Coast. All this logging that's been done by these large companies. Yeah, all these cut logs, that, that's all their waste here that keeps washing up on our shorelines. Not saying Fukushima is not a problem, but uh, let's approach it from a real perspective. And that would be by buying a Geiger counter spectrometer so we can check 
a gamma spectrometer. I want to isolate the isotopes here. I live on Vancouver Island. That's what this video is all about here on Connecting Dots 2, Connecting Dots 3 YouTube channel. Go check it out. If you don't want to help out, that's great. But at least stay informed here and remember the names. Thank you.